Uh, in Richmond, it's in Richmond, really close to the Aberdeen Skytrain station. So, yeah, yeah, you make that commitment. Come check it out. Uh, we're all super nice people. Venue's awesome too. It's really like when I walked in for the first time, it was something I didn't expect. I expected. Like I thought the Burnby one was awesome, but this is just This is sick, life. right? Yeah. yeah, no, we we we've really tried to make this better and we're still not done yet. There's a lot of stuff in the staff room that needs to be put up. Yeah. Okay. Well, these two guys, they've played quite a lot. They practice a lot when they want to try new characters. They 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 spend a lot of time playing friendlies over at uh Zaxo. So, they definitely know their play styles. So, it's it's a matter of like seeing um, who can uh, uh, like beat out the other and we're seeing Zach incredible job of just totally dominating in neutral and getting the just the right punishes you know what I mean yeah I what do you what do you think about this matchup Coley I know you're pretty fresh to this game but what do you think <laughs> I have no idea because all I know is G Kong's neutral is very I don't know when I whenever I played against a Diddy Kong it's just I played against, uh, what's his name, T TJ. He was just on commentary. Oh, yeah, TJ. Mm -hmm. It's like you have to, well, you can't mess up because yeah, it hard, man. Like, down, like he has very fast moves, mm -hmm. like down tilt. And then if you get hit by that. It converts, it converts into kill options. Mm -hmm. Yeah, or, or like follow-ups or grabs or something. Yeah, it's crazy. Uh, to answer your question, uh, Proto, uh, no, but I live really close, and I love VSB. And since it's so close, um, I feel like it's like my due part to like just make this like this uh, kind of community grow and help out when I can. I've donated artworks and stuff, and when they put up more things, I'm gonna try to do my best and just make it like a great place. Cause you know it's like I ran a video game club in my high school, and it was just a great feeling to have like people come and like share their passion and like get better at what they want to do and like just feel comfortable right it's a, it's a it's a it's a place to escape that's what i'm trying to say yeah so i i if they offer me a staff position <laughs> oh i'll take it for whatever it may be but if not i'm still always going to help out yeah like kenny i'm in debt to kenny clinton long these guys are great uh and they, they, they do a really good job vsb's like excellent so yeah good stuff guys i actually like if i don't mind bringing this up I. Uh, yeah, this, this happened in June or early late June, like mm -hmm. so the end of the like, high school year. Yeah, yeah. They had a uh, high school only t like competitive Smash Four tournament. Oh, VSB? No. Oh, well, oh, oh, like oh. it was a s it was at Tupper Secondary in mm. Vancouver. Right, I know, I know about Tupper. Yeah, and I went to that. It was it was awesome. Even though it was, like they they had CRTs for setups. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wait, for Smash for Wii U? Smash for Wii U, yeah. Wow, that's weird. It's weird. Because, like, well, it's high school. They don't have, like... HD, yeah, they don't have monitors. They can't, like... I don't think it I don't think it would make it laggy, would it? Well. Oh, nice stuff. But, yeah, because, like, I went to... They have a club there as well. Mm -hmm. And they recently bought a monitor. So, like, oh, yeah. Nice. And they do a lot of fundraising for... Because I go there and they have, like... Everyone there, they just want to get better. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's what VSB is all about too, guys. Like seriously, if you want a tip too, like go ahead. But just supporting it, making this place grow is great. But yeah, I'm, I'm glad to hear that, mm -hmm. that that you had like a high school club that like totally did it. It's 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 great. Yeah, Cyrex, mm -hmm. uh, Yusuf. Oh, I think wow. they played in Grands, and I think Yusuf 3-0. Yeah. So, man, Yusuf's nuts. Yeah, Yusuf didn't drop a game. Yeah, everyone here is crazy. Our scene is really growing. Like, I mean, look at this. Zach took a game off Captain L's Pika. Like, I mean, I, of course the matchup knowledge is there, but like, that's crazy. Like, Zach used to be, um, you know, yeah, everyone still makes fun of him anyways, but he he used to be someone who was like, kind of like, you know, just kind of fresh, like, learning, but now he's like, developed into like, easily one of the, like, the best players our region has to offer. And he, I think he performed well at, I think it was Genesis. Genesis 4. Four. Yeah, Four. I think he performed really well there. And he should be definitely proud of that. Mm. Like, look, look, like this isn't like a dominating game for Captain L or like or Zach or anything. This is just super close. Nice air dodge, by the way. Uh, making sure you can evade that. Dance speed battle. FYI, can he start hosting VSB so he can get good at Street Fighter 4? Yeah, see, it's kind of <laughs> weird how you like your hobbies can develop develop into your careers that's what everyone should do so 
guys, keep keep your fighting games a hobby, but uh, also go towards and strive for your dreams, right? Mm. That's what I'm trying to tell you. I mean, I, I think Zach, one of Zach's dreams is actually probably to be like a kind of a pro player, get up there, you know, like try to prove to himself, and it's it's a big boost of confidence, right? That's why people are here. Yeah. Look at look at this, man. Zach, I'm I'm com com so good. I'm commending Zach. He's like doing a really good job. Yeah. Like. I, I love it, like underdog stories. You're not supposed to have like biased commentary, but like I love both these players. But it's it's crazy to see that like we're all developing to just being this good, man. What would you say like a year ago, like if they played right like the oh this a year ago? Up, like, a year oh, ago, Zach would have played Duck Hunt. Or no, I like mean that. like how would he fare against Captain Up? Mm. How would he fare? Um, it wouldn't be like this. It would be much more clean on Captain L's side. There'd be holes in Zach's neutral game, uh, okay. but Zach has developed a, a strong neutral just through a lot of experience, practice, and knowledge, and being aware. Um, and see, Zach's very like emotional and focused about the game. When he loses a stock, he shakes his head. Like he's always constantly thinking. You can see it. Um, you guys can see in the player cam when you're watching down there how much Zach is really emotive when he plays. He puts his all into it. That's what you should do. Even if you play like games like ping pong or whatever, you gotta like put your whole body into it. Yeah, he really is doing that. I guess it's just like some people. Uh, uh, Josh, I knew you were gonna make that joke. I was waiting. I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, do you see it? Like, like um, right now we're providing kind of more commentary, not so much on the, the match, but like what our scene is kind of being. And look at this. It's like it's it's nuts, man. It's great. Yeah. Yeah, I, I think it, I think it's cool. Like just. Oh, nice stuff. That was really good, down B. So Honestly, yeah, he, uh, Captain L is really really good at like. Reading people with down B. Oh, he's gonna yeah. suffer for this. So it's, I mean, it's close. Yeah, mm -hmm. definitely mm -hmm. close. Definitely which is, close. which is like, I mean, I, I haven't been to a lot of tournaments, so maybe this isn't surprising, but it is a little surprising to me. So, mm. nice spot dodge. So I think Captain L. Well, hopefully he doesn't get too anti when trying to go for a kill. Mm -hmm. Hopefully he takes his time because like, yeah, one opening and that's gonna be it. Yeah, Ca Captain L's uh, gameplay style back at Randall City was described as someone who like slowly like it's an attrition battle. He wants to like like he if he wanted to whittle you out, it'd be like slowly over time. So I think he knows when to take like uh, not go too overboard with anything, right? Yeah, I think that's like yeah, it's good to like mix up like when you're gonna commit hard and when you're not gonna commit because obviously like. You're, you want to have like when you're gonna commit hard. You want to have like some like background, like yeah, sem yeah. You need a semblance of understanding of I'm committing because I've seen a visual cue that this will work, and that's that's a big thing. And sometimes like that's it's, it's weird, right? Mm -hmm. That's why that's why banana is weird. Sometimes you want to go for it, and the banana like totally messes up your plans. Yeah, like mm -hmm. wow, this is crazy. Uh, this is a. Uh, uh, FD, which I think is like probably better for Pikachu because it just allows Pikachu to kind of like uh, um, kind of face Diddy Kong head on. Of course, you're gonna have to deal with the banana that's on the floor consistently, but uh, yeah. But again, like look at this. Like I'm, I'm telling you, man. Like this, this is insane. Like usually, like oh man, look at that. Really good down here, and that's gonna he's gonna be at 91 percent. And guys, uh, Pikachu isn't that light. Or, uh, I mean, uh, that heavy. He's fairly light, not super light, but he's fairly light. So. They, this kind of percent is uh, devastating for it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I see what you mean. I yeah. Mean. And Coley, you see the like, stage control here? This is really good from Zach. Do you know why that's good? You want to leave some insight? Yeah. Why it's important to have stage control? <laughs> because you could, you could, I guess you could force what you want. Your yeah, to exactly. Do. Yeah. Dude, see? Right answer. I know it's not school, but like, that was, that was a good answer. Because <laughs> the thing about having stage control with Diddy Kong 2 is you have the banana at your disposal. So it's kind of like it. It's a lot of things for the opponent to receive and respond to. Like, oh, nice up smash! It's like, do I, how do I gonna get around this banana? How am I gonna get around the, the Diddy Kong? How is the Diddy Kong gonna respond to my get up options? What get up options should I use? Yeah, that kind of thing. And which get up options are no longer op uh, opt uh, an option because of the banana. So it's really smart from him. Now this is what I like to call again. Oh, okay. I was gonna say this is a gravy period where you can see how much percent he can put off, but he wasn't able to put up that much. 14% against 0%, and a game like this, that's basically they're even. They're they're like, they're they're, they're essentially just straight up even. Yeah, I, well, at this point, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we've seen a lot of uh, uh, Captain Hill fans in the chat. 
A lot of Zach fans, a lot of everyone is uh, cheering on who they want to win. I have no bias. Yeah. I just. I, I, I have no <laughs> bias either. I'm just shocked that Zach's doing really well. Like, I love to see this improvement. It's nuts. Yeah. So, right now. Oh, okay. Captain L. That was yeah, really catching it. Yeah. Catching now, it. now we're seeing, I think, Captain L is adapting to uh, Zach's Diddy and what, it, what it's doing. Because, like. Oh. Yeah. Oh man! Because like I hopefully I think he might be catching on to Zach getting like Andy like oh he has the lead so I gotta like do something so yeah. Captain Nail's gonna respond. Yeah, Zach Zach can't let his emotions get in the way of um, making the right choices here uh, in terms of applying pressure that's safe and also will work. It, it might take time, but yeah. Oh, ooh. and that that's ooh, no, he's that's gonna survive. It. Expert DI. This a ooh. Oh, uh Oh, oh man, what if that killed? What if that killed? That was a weird interaction. Yeah, see, that's the inconsistency that I'm talking about. You see that? That up smash, like, totally missed the last few hits. Oh, see, he was fishing for the clapping, and then he's going to get thrown for it. Yeah, because probably looking to... Because, like, he knew it wouldn't convert. Oh, man, and th that that landing wasn't safe. He's, he's, oh, he's, just, he's just going for the clap. Mm. This is very similar to watching, like, Locus, like, do his, like, up, up tilt. It's kind of like, because it's, it, it is definitely the option that's going to get it, and it's a fast move. Yeah, that's it. There it is. Mm. Nice. Good stuff. Yeah, don't worry, Risk Guy. You don't have to. You don't have to feel like you shouldn't be biased. Uh, you're on commentary. Yeah. So you you, you can <laughs> definitely say what you like. You can you can have a strong opinion. So what do you? Well, so it was uh was it, so Captain L goes to Smashville. What do you think about S that? Smashville? Oh, what what do I think about Smashville here? I, well. Again, it was kind of like the same thing why I said like FD was probably good, but now you have the platform as well. So you can kind of retreat to the platform as well and kind of use that as a way to uh, come down onto Diddy Kong. Oh, yeah, totally. But I think it's also just a comfort pick. Like, everyone loves Smashville. Right? Mm -hmm. That's why everyone in B I don't know if it's a BC thing yeah. that everyone and just gentlemen to Smashville. It, it's it's not. You go to Evo, you go to like everyone in like, uh, Seattle, people just love Smashville. It's just because it's, it's a stage that's very neutral. Oh, oh, that SD. The stage is very neutral, and it's gonna be uh, that uh, that SD is gonna cost him. He he's gonna need to work a lot harder now if he wants to um, secure this game as a win. Mm -hmm. At 62%, it won't take that many hits to get there, but it's still gonna be tough. Nice stuff, nice nice stuff. Like Captain L is really good at like uh, coming from the ledge and making it work, making it uh, converting uh, recover from the ledge to some nice damage. And that was a really nice punish using up tilt to get the, rid of the side beat. Cause like I want to like I hasn't I haven't been t paying attention at the ledge. Like maybe is it because like he's like kind of ambiguous on when he wants to get up, mm -hmm. or like kind of like that, right? Yeah. Look like, at those quick attacks, man. Ooh. Nice back air. I I should like pay like two dollars every time I say that, but that was <laughs> <laughs> that was like. So I mean, I guess Captain yeah. L. Hopefully, doesn't force anything. Whoa! Just, what? Oh, what? It, what is with know. this? This game is a really unfortunate game. That was SD. Well, I don't know if that was an SD. That was definitely an SD, SD too. Yeah, I think he was. I think he was trying to go low so he can come back from the, uh, the with the barrel, or maybe he was trying to use the 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 the, the barrel to go to the other side, but. He, he so this is a best of five set. Yeah, everyone, everyone cheering for Zach. Good stuff. <laughs> I mean, Captain L is great too, but like, uh, he, we're both uh, we we'll love both these players. But yeah, this is this is it though, guys. This is Smashville again. You didn't feel like the stage is what caused the loss here. Uh, they're gonna gentlemen both back to the stage again, and they're gonna try. This is the last game of this set. Winners finals. Whoever moves on goes straight to grands, while the other is sent to losers finals. Losers finals. I think we still have loser semis. Yeah, we have we still have a lot to go through. Uh, all these games need to just be finished on stream. So yeah, everyone's here. We don't have a lot of people left chilling here. We have like about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's nine of us still right now. Mm -hmm. uh, but that's because we had a lot of attendees like really early when it's said that. Hey TJ, you were just on commentary earlier. Yeah, you should be studying. I should be studying. Yeah. <laughs> How far do you live, TJ? Let's. See. Oh. Yeah. Right. See, this is this is exactly what I'm talking about with like Captain L and wanting to like 
just wait out and just whittle whittle him down bit by bit without having to commit at all. Yeah. That's the best way because there's no rush. This game is slow. The timer's pretty long. Like you don't have to worry about it. We're yeah. only like we're only like just a little bit of after a minute. So I think that's I think that's very like you said about like whittling away slowly. Ooh. Yeah. And he's getting antsy. Look, yeah. see, see, Zach's very emotive. He's he's getting frustrated, and at this point, he needs to he needs to uh, find a game plan so that he can um, he can be able to get through this um, Pikachu, right? I hope it's not like I hope it didn't get in his head. I, th I think it's I think it's kind of is because what's happening right now is he's being har mm. harshly punished for any option. Yeah, I feel like I think like the rolls and like the monkey flips. the way he drifts. Yeah, is just. And the moves that he's throwing out is just like kind of auto. Like I wouldn't say autopiloting. Mm, no, it's, it's just, not autopiloting, but it's, it's like, just like it's like, snap habits. Yeah, it's, it's like the, the, these would offer me the best reward when I hit them. So I, I need to. I want to throw them out now in hopes that I can get some reward off of it. Oh, nice! Now, on the way down, he gets a jab. And he he jab escapes the jab. Let's, what? Mm. See, ah. Uh, this isn't this isn't it just for uh, him because oh, look that nice not. F smash that that's definitely gonna take it ninety six percent this is backwards optimal oh damn it oh. backwards <laughs> optimal percent <See. laughs> I love <I> <laughs> nice oh my god come on guys have faith in uh in, in your boy even though if Captain L takes this it's 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 deservedly so Captain L so good puts in a lot of time in this I mean, oh. So hopefully Zach, while he has stage control, can regain some percent to make make up for it. Yeah. Look yeah, though, this is he's, he has stage control. Like Sixty four. Look, it's pretty oh, good. They, they, oh, oh, it rolls good, on. Good, 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 good. <laughs> that, that, yeah. See there, that that ledge option, the, the get up option was vital. If it was improper, he would have died for it. Like, I think it's like when you're at that like high percent, you just like start thinking like in that zone. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my God. What oh man, I'm sitting on the edge of my seat again. They're at 100. It's the last game, and air dodge read. Oh no, the air dodge read. He's not, he's not able to get, uh, capitalize on that high enough back throw. Oh. And back here at monkey flip. Oh, and, and the thunder gonna catch him. This is leaving Wait, Zach he vulnerable he in the air. Oh, what's he gonna do? Back air. That's might kill. Wow. Yeah, back air gonna kill. Good stuff. That was so close. Down to the wire. I don't know. Like I wasn't like 